Atmos crews are still working to fix gas leaks in the northwest Dallas neighborhood, and we have learned that at least an additional 40 homes have now been evacuated in that area overnight. Our photographer, Jake Shannon, says that you can smell gas throughout the neighborhood, sparking more frustration and concerns among residents there. CBS 11's Brittany Jeffers is at the nearby fire station that was also evacuated last night. Brittany. Yeah, Russ, as you mentioned, those firefighters had to leave. And since then, Atmos crews have been out here at work. Uh, ever since we arrived this morning, we have seen them out here. Of course, this happening just blocks away from that deadly explosion that's left the neighborhood on edge. Now, there was a town hall meeting last night. And during that, frustrated residents took turns asking how those gas leaks were ignored, culminating in the explosion on Friday that killed a little girl. Now, we know that the gas company says that they are working on maps to show people where they're working to replace the pipes. And the gas provider is expanding gas leak testing zones out of what it calls an abundance of caution. Now, Atmos says they expect to have gas service tentatively restored by Sunday. But, of course, things could change. And at this point, there are about 300 people who have been evacuated from their homes, either, either uh, through mandatory orders or simply out of fear. Of course, we'll continue to follow this and bring you updates throughout the day. Live here in Dallas, I'm Brittany Jeffers, CBS 11 News.